Hi, so yes, at Sunset Hills Medical, we're uh, applying for a grower, processor, and dispensary licenses for uh, medical cannabis in Pennsylvania. Um, so our goal is to secure those licenses and um, build a facility here, a 25 to 50,000 square foot facility in Clarion in the Glassworks Business Park, um, which should employ initially 50 employees um, and up to 120 employees over a five year time period. Is this a grow facility? Yes, this would be a grow facility and then uh, on Route 68 we've purchased property to uh, uh, open a proposed dispensary on 68, the old Clary Clipper building. Great. When do you anticipate starting with this? Well, we are uh, uh, anticipating hearing from the State Department of Health on the awardees for the licenses sometime in uh, the next couple of months. How many uh, will they be awarding? Obviously, we've heard about the money around the book that it's a larger group. So the state has talked about issuing uh, 12 to 13 more grower processor licenses and 28 dispensaries in this uh, phase two round of the application process. Is this the first time you've done these things? Yes, yes. We did not apply in phase one. We've really taken the last uh, year and a half or so to research the industry um, to get our team together to make sure that um, when we did it, we did it right. Um, and we're all Pennsylvania business owners, entrepreneurs, um, with varying backgrounds. Now I noticed with the, the Brookfield facility there was a representative. It's highly regulated as it should be. Um, the application process that the Department of Health uh, put together is very thorough, very good. Um, and there's uh, a tremendous amount of regulation. There's technologies being used to track all of the uh, plants, uh, the products from seed to sale, so it's highly regulated.